The eatery with the low inspection score is in Hamlin County. Several critical violations are marked off in the report. The greatest is 75 at Golden Dragon on Andrew Johnson Highway in Morristown. That 75 is a passing score. Any grade below 70 is considered failing. The inspector has returned for a follow-up and that score in just a moment. The inspector writes that he watched an employee dry his hands on his apron. Can't do that because aprons are usually dirty. Had that employee tried to wash his hands as required, he would have found no soap at the hand sink beside the food preparation table. When the content of the dishwasher's sanitizer solution was checked, it read zero. The inspector directed the manager to fix the issue immediately. There's more. And this one is hard to believe. The inspector writes he found frozen shrimp thawing in the mop sink. Yes. The inspector had the manager remove the shrimp immediately from the mop sink. Also, frozen raw chicken was left out thawing at room temperature. To slow bacteria growth, one way to properly thaw frozen food is in the refrigerator. Now, the inspector returned to the Golden Dragon in Morristown. During the follow-up, the inspector found all of the original violations were corrected and the new grade is a 91. No need for any second inspections at the top scoring restaurants, and here are the best grades of the week. In Knoxville, Hannah's Cafe on Central Street, 100. In West Knoxville, the Panda Express on Parkside Drive also scores 100. Taco Bell, the one on Clinton Highway in Knoxville, is perfect. Also perfect is Twister's Diner on Washington Pike in North Knoxville. In Jefferson City, Hardy's on Broadway Boulevard scores 100. Here's another 100 scored at Bojangles, the one in Jefferson City. In Maryville, the KFC on Foothills Mall Drive receives a 99, same grade 99 for Arby's, the one on the parkway in Sevierville. Inspectors come around and check restaurants every six months. If you notice an issue, politely let the manager know. If nothing is done, call the health department in your county. Don Dare covering Food for Thought. All right, Don, thank you. And if you'd like to look over all of this week's health inspection scores for yourself, we've made it very easy for you to do that. They are all under the Ask CNN section of WATE.com.